Hello everybody and welcome to this episode of BC Skate Tours. My name is Brian. I'm Chris. And this is the grand opening of Oro Valley's first skate park and pump track. We're going to go ahead and check out the grand opening of all this and give you a tour of the skate park along the way. So uh, join us and see what's here. Just want to take a quick break real quick to advertise my other channel that I'm just starting. I'm trying to get to 100 subscribers so please check it out in the description below. It's all about hiking, backpacking, camping, and anything mother nature. So uh, check that channel out. Appreciate you guys. Back to the video. Town of Oro Valley Skate Park and Pump Track Guidelines, hours 6 a.m. to 10 p.m. Neither the skate park nor pump track are supervised, so the following guidelines are provided for your safety. Park use, the skate park is solely for use by skateboarders, scooters, and skaters, inline and conventional equipment with soft wheels. The pump track is to be used solely by BMX and similarly equipped bicycles with rubber tires. Neither the skate park nor the pump track are for use with motorized vehicles or with additional ramps, jumps, obstacles, or modifications of any kind. For the safety of the pets, skaters, and cyclists, please do not bring pets into either the pump track or the skate park. Safety equipment is recommended but not required. Safety equipment includes helmets, elbow pads, knee pads, and wrist guards. Basically skate park respect. So this is the half pipe here, the open-ended bowl. Sweet mini ramp here. This is definitely very mellow. Easy for beginners. Nice tall wall over there. It's almost vert, but not we got our table here with the box nice kink rail gotta try to stay out of everybody's way at this point and then you got a couple of sweet ass curbs over here with a nice mani pad about curb high makes it perfect for beginners grandpas skilled people alike that was sweet yeah got a nice shin high rail about two inch uh, round rail a box here fully coped there is definitely no shade here so you know there's plenty of spaces for you to bring your own pop-up tent pop up some shade and have a skate session under some shade definitely is an option unless the law says something about it so here's our other table here this mini this mani pad just slopes down on the return got a nice kinked rail on the back end over there it'd be pretty sweet to see uh tyrone olsen hit this the ov wall and then it transitions right here back into the kidney bowl kidney bowl is all fully coped everything's metal coping in this park there's no pull put coping nice polished concrete uh, so if you like to power slide, plenty of option for power sliding here. And uh, I'm going to let Chris show you the pump track. You know, there's not much to this skate park, but it is a brilliant run, both for transitional skaters and street skaters. This isn't a bad park, but when you add this many people here getting us uh, uh, some time to skate, it's going to be difficult. And to be totally honest with you, I have a funny feeling this is going to really turn into a scooter haven. So if you skate and ride BMX, I would definitely uh, choose to skate during school hours when uh, this won't be overran by the, all the scooter kids. But I can imagine by uh, this afternoon, tomorrow, it'll be mostly skate uh, scooter kids that take over this park, especially in its location. So I'm going to pass it over to Chris and let him show you the, the pump track. All right, everybody, so this is the pump track part. Anyway, Chris here, by the way. So this thing is amazing. They say it's for all bikes, but I've been seeing people hitting it with some skateboards. Dang, people are flying. See, see. Looks like they got more than enough lighting out here. Yeah, this pump track is huge. Look at this thing. We did a really good job on it. We've been really excited for this thing to open. Like Brian was saying, the layout of this park is 
absolutely great. It's got a great flow to it. So busy. Can't wait till it thins out a little bit. Look at that. thing is thought out really, really well. Anyway, we're back to the entrance. They got facilities on site, water fountain, a half pipe, plenty of parking for people. All right, well, anyway, that's the pump part. The pump track portion. And we'll see you on the next one. That's gonna go ahead and do it for this episode of BC Skate Tours. My name is Brian. If you enjoy hiking, backpacking, camping, solo hiking, things like that, check out my other channel. I'm trying to get to 100 subscribers. I appreciate it for my fellow subscribers here to help me out with that. The link is down in the, in the description below and I'll leave it on the comments. I appreciate you guys and uh, go out there and skate, have fun and enjoy life. If you like our videos, hit the like button down below. It'll really help us out. If you're new here, hit the subscribe button right here. Check out a playlist of all kinds of skate park tours right here. Check out all the local skaters right here. And here is a special video chosen by YouTube just for you right here.